Welcome Mountain Beachers. Here we are exploring more of our own backyard. We're heading up the canyon to uh, Tony Grove, which typically is bursting with wildflowers. But we think we might have hit it a little bit early this year, but we're going to go up and give it a look anyway. Yep, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter with you? I don't know. <laughs> that, was, that was pathetic. <laughs> Okay, so welcome back and Tony Grove is at an elevation of about 8,000 foot. It's a lake that is glacially made and uh, it's a beautiful hike. We love going up there. It's a great hike because you can go, well, number one, it's a beautiful drive up to the lake. And then once you get to the lake, you have options. You can just stay around the lake, which is a nice little, I think a little bit over a one mile stroll, basically. Um, or you can get a little more strenuous and you can go to up higher to a high mountain lake called White Pine. Or you can go to Naomi Peak, which is all the way to the top of the mountain. I think it's, that's almost 10,000 feet. Not today. Not today, <laughs> maybe later in the summer. Yeah, the wildflowers are usually in uh, July and August, August and into uh, early August. So we might be just a little bit too early. Um, but we're gonna go take yeah. a look. Yeah, so. Come along with us. It'll be beautiful no matter what. Yeah, fun times. So we wanted to give you a picture of the lake behind us in the background, but we really just wanted to stop and take a rest. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the beginning of a season always takes a while to get back into the groove. Ugh. We're out of shape. We're out of shape, but that's okay. We're up here. We're working on it. Wind, here comes the wind. Okay, so Naomi Peak is 3.3 miles to the left, White Pine Lake 3.8 to the right, but Naomi Peak is a harder hike. We're not going to either one. We're going to head towards White Pine, but we're not making it all the way. Even though it's only 3.8, it's, uh, it's a pretty good hike. rocks look at this lichen in it and all the different colors the gray the crevices the red absolutely gorgeous We've got a little more moss down here these walk rocks were part of the glacier movement through the valley which made this valley and the high mountain lake just, it's so fun to see this evidence, this huge evidence of how this valley was formed. I just can't love it more. Come to the water where you will find peace. Take a step into the river. Get down on your knees. Come to the mountain. We'll take it in the view. Find the life is greater than you knew when you go through the storm. I will hold you, keep you warm. When you stay in the night, I will shelter, I will find, I will find. Oh. Okay. 
looking at me shattered At the point of no return You pick up the pieces And you let the bridges burn So come to the water You're sailing with the breeze Take a step into the river Where you will find peace Where you go through the storm I will hold you, keep you warm Where you stay in the night I will shelter, I will fight So come to the water Where you will find peace Take a step into the river And get down on your knees Ooh, I think we got some wild mint growing here. Ooh, smell that. Oh, it smells so good. Wild sage here. So this is a trick that, if I remember right, we learned from our friend Joni, take the wild sage, oh my gosh, and it smells so good, and just rub it in your hands, and get that scent even more, and then that supposedly, if I remember right, will tell you, helps keep the bugs away. But if it doesn't, it still smells wonderful. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. Oh. You had me at a low Cause where you go is where I go I don't need nobody else I got you And you got me too You can ride all the blue Wake up! Oh, do I have to? <laughs> we can leave and run away Someday Someday A fantastic day it has been absolutely beautiful day we're almost back down to the parking lot but we thought we'd kind of wrap things up up here while we're still on the hillside it's much more beautiful and, and not so many people not so many people <laughs> yeah it was a little crowded up here today i was surprised yep usually don't run into this many people so i'd give this five out of five stars for the oh. for this hike and this uh this beauty absolutely there's so many things that are in our own backyard, especially in our area. But like we've said before, 
there's things in your own backyard and we want to know about those so please comment below let us know what beautiful things are around you that when we get in our RV and going more full time that we can come and visit you and see what's in your backyard. Yeah, because we're going to visit your state. We're yep. going to visit everywhere and we want to know what there is to do. The, the hidden secrets that you know that <laughs> we no don't. no one else knows. Nobody else knows. You can share those with us. We're not going to tell anybody. But this is it. When you come to Utah and the Logan Cache Valley area, this is a definite must. Tony Grove. Tony Grove. It's up Logan Canyon. Beautiful drive up here and the hike, you can make it as easy or as difficult as you want. There's so many options. There's the hike around the lake that is just an easy hike. I think you can even bring strollers around the lake. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure, at least part way. And then the hike that we went on, you just go until you're ready to turn around. That's what yeah. we did. Or if you're more adventurous, you can hike all the way to White Pine Lake. Which is, you should do it. If you've got that in you, you should do White Pine. It's oh, it's beautiful. A, it's so beautiful. We'll do that another day and share that. And if you're really adventurous and have your hiking legs and you're, uh, you're accl acclimated to that altitude. And your water, lots and lots, lots of, water. of water. Then do the hike to Naomi Peak. Yep. Spectacular. It's so. well worth the effort. So thanks so much for joining us. That's going to do it for us for this week. And we really, really appreciate you watching and following us. If you haven't joined yet, please subscribe. Like us. And give us a thumbs up on this video. So thanks for coming along. And we'll catch you later. Bye-bye. What we do is what we do. I can take you anywhere